Hey friends, we'll be back into this new video tutorial with always people. In this video today, I'm going to explain to you guys something later about uh, something called mobile app development but using web technologies. We are not going to hesitate showing you this because we know you need to know that and you need to get find yourself started and you come up with a simple application. Now, without wasting a lot of time, you guys may be from Uganda and you may say, I really want to do this, I want to know this, I want to come up with this. Uh, the room is there for you. Always be a digital solution, provide all of these programs just at our training center here in Wandega. Diamond Trust Bank building, we are in the second floor. So, if you find that you're interested in these programs of ours, then I wish you the best to come in and get to know how to get started. Now, I may just start with uh, a simple web application that I've just designed some time back. Uh, it has all the parts responsive. This is jQuery. is very stable and is making this part of the application work as normally. If I happen to click on here to, to, uh, to do what? To, to sign out, I think you can see the application is just going to be signing out automatically. And I think you see the search on this side is getting up. You just see where the section is getting up there, and as the other part works, the application on this side also finalizes very well. There are many formats still how we can also get up this application of ours. We can go to 50%, we can get take back to 75%, we can also go back to rotate it to other position by default to be that. The other side may be like a kind of big for us, so we can reduce it a little bit back to to 55% or 50%. Mm -hmm. Now, this might not be new to some of you guys, but I'm talking of making up an application that sits exactly to that given width. Let me take it back again to this normal size of it being in a lateral uh, landscape, and then I try to increase this one to 75%. We're just going to give assumption I'm going to log into this system. When I just log into the system, you'll be seeing the system processing and is finalizing up all this stuff. So coming up with such kind of applications is very stable and it has all the features needed. Then if you also happen to decide to come and click on here, it's very responsive and I think you can see it is picks up. You may even think it is a tablet. Now if you are interested in such kind of system, then I just advise you come to OSP Addictor Solution, come and learn how to make one. Now this piece of our code which we came up with that given application is just around us here. Now this is some of the serials or some of the calls that I came up with to join up to come up with that given application. All the calls are joined up together with a given session called uh, and this is given one function called functions.php. These are all the functions that are happen to handle to wish to join up all the PHP calls and then to come up with the given application that you have just seen. The system is also integrated with the API which sends messages and all those sessions. So something like that is all complete in this complete application. Now if you are told you might be interested also on the other way around we also happen to have to declare a simple function that can be used to handle our errors page whenever we have errors. I give a scenario if I happen to come in and to this system of ours and then I try to say maybe I give going to the assumption I'm going to be logging out into this system and then I try to give or try to work on with the wrong details. The system can simply now detect who, what has ever happened in the application. So if I just happen to add you there more kind of uh, stuff like that. Sorry. If I just start to add there with the long stuff, the application is also very wise by detecting up what's there and then with a few times it goes and disappears back. So my friends, I'm not going to take a lot of your time, but at least I've shown you how to come up with one on us a simple one on us a simple a simple HTML5 mobile app application. If you're really interested to come up with a complete application with even the database this side around, which you happen to join up with, come up with this given database that we're using up in maybe in this system, which is having with a big architecture design and all of this session. These are all the tables we have in this database. And all those stuffs are working well and they're joined together. So guys, if you find this video interesting, please just come to OSP Addictor Solution, come and register for your program. 
come on and see software development and system design and also one on us mobile app development for those guys of you who might be interested on one on us html5 web based applications come on make a responsive complete app at always fair digital solutions together we can make it for innovative it digital solutions so guys i wish you nice time as i'm waiting to see you around here come on an application at a very affordable fee so don't get worried about maybe the fee coming the point that coming we shall always find a way out for you we want you to learn we want you to get to know things so wish you a nice day as you're coming organizing to come to OSP. wish you a nice day may god bless you thank you